Dennis Ployce here with Jeffco Communications and Athletic Department. We're here at Columbine High School today with Columbine Junior Luke O'Brien. Luke is one of the stars on Columbine's basketball team. He's already verbally committed to the University of Colorado to play basketball. We're going to fire some questions off to Luke to get him to know him just a little bit better. All right, Luke, thanks for joining us today. Um, first, uh, when did you start playing basketball? Uh, probably when I was like five or six, I played in like this carpet basketball league. So like I came to like these elementary schools, they're just carpet for the court and it was like seven foot hoops. So yeah. Did you really, grow up in Colorado here? I did. Yeah. I grew up actually in Highland Ranch up until I was in eighth grade and then we moved and then went to Colorado. Yeah. When did you really feel that you could be one of the top high school basketball players in the state of Colorado? I mean, I feel like I've kind of always felt it, you know, I just worked as hard as I could. I knew like in seventh and eighth grade, this was like, I had to separate myself because I definitely wasn't the best player in middle school, seventh and eighth grade. And then freshman year when I made varsity, I was like, this is, this is where I have to put myself, you know, my name out there. So, yeah. Talk about a little bit about your verbal commitment mm -hmm. to yeah. University of Colorado, why you decided yeah. Colorado and why so early only a junior yeah. and you decide to uh, back in yeah November. a lot of people keep telling me like why did you go so early but when I came up there I was blown away by the facilities the players when I hung out with them amazing people and then the coaches were just incredible like that was just a chance I could not you know slip away from me so I, I can't wait to be a buff for yeah. sure. um, let's look back at last season a little bit um, sharing that league title with Arvada West. Kind of talk about that run a little bit that you guys yeah, had. Yeah, it was, it was a good run. Um, we definitely improved my freshman year to my sophomore year. And, you know, sharing the league title, I disappointing, you know, because, you know, you want the top spot. But I felt like it was a successful season nonetheless because of the way that we finished, you know. So Yeah. It had been six years since Columbine Boys had won the league title. Was that a big focus for you guys? Oh yeah, that was that was our main goal going into the season. Like we got to win league this year, and we also you know got to make the playoffs, obviously. But league was definitely the top of our list. So yeah, Columbine's obviously known as a football school yeah. a lot for what they've yeah. done there. Is it hard playing basketball in a school that has such a strong? football reputation? Um, it's not hard at all. I feel like there's more fans that know Columbine's more football, but then again, our whole basketball team is made up of football players, so they're obviously involved with other sports, so it's not. it doesn't make it hard on anybody. I feel like the football players know that football's not the only thing here at Columbine, so, you know. Talk about those football players and what they bring to the court. Um, obviously, some grit and oh, some God. size and some they, muscle, but just talk about They just guys. bring so much defense and intensity, and they just work so hard in practice and games. It's like they never get tired or something like that. It's like, it's insane. And, you know, you got all these football players that can transition from football to basketball so quickly. It's just incredible. So, yeah. Talk about you guys start in league play here, just started uh, this last week. Talk a little bit about what your expectations are for league, a little bit of a different look, mm -hmm. obviously with just playing once a go around right. and Valor, who you guys yeah. beat in the league opener um, in there. Well, uh -huh. What are your expectations for this league? I feel like we should go undefeated for sure. I mean, I feel like we're one of the top teams. I feel like if we just play hard every game, I, I think we'll be league champs this year. So I'm excited. It's been a while, 1997, since you guys have won a state title. Um, and the Columbine was the last big school from Jeffco even to do that. What will it take for Jeffco to bring that state title in the largest classification for boys mm -hmm. basketball back, you think? I, I just feel like our team is, you know, one of the top teams this year. I feel like if we go out there and we, we are, pride ourselves on the defensive end and we take care of business there, I feel like everything will take care of on the offensive end. I think we can beat anybody in the state, to be honest. Is there another talent mm -hmm. that you have that people might not know about that you have or that you do? Any other sports that you're involved with uh, growing up or anything? Oh, uh, so I used to be a football guy, actually. I used to really love football. That was like basically one of my main sports that I really wanted to do. And then I had like four or five concussions. So I was like, probably stop. And I was like around like seventh grade, sixth grade. And then I was like, you know, I'm getting taller. That's what might be, you know, the moves. So. Yeah. What did you play in football? What was your position? Quarterback and a safety in corner. So. Yeah. Do you have any throwing contests at all with Logan to see who can throw better so, football? I sometimes bring out the arm, you know. 
I sometimes come out and like, you know, I played quarterback back in sixth grade. And he's like, this is sixth grade. I'm like, but yeah, we sometimes do. He beats me every time. So. <laughs> All right. Thank you for your time, Luke. Good luck for the rest of the season for the Rebels. Yeah. Make sure everybody goes out and checks them out. They'll be a fun team to watch this year. Um, and thank you for supporting Jeffco Athletics.